Good to see you. This is Scott. He runs the show. Right on. Show's yeah. around, man. All right, this cool. is home, right? Yeah, yeah, this is home. I mean, this is where we're at every day, and sometimes more days than we'd like per week. But uh, yeah, I'll show you around, including the barking dog. Cool. <laughs> you know, this is actually uh, one of the first ones we made. Um, you'll notice the uh, original free ride. That was the first board ever made by original, a free ride in 2002. Oh, cool. This is uh, Brad's office. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Come on, come on. Looks like uh, Petter's getting back to it. Petter, you working hard? Yeah, so much. <laughs> Petter helps out with a lot of the, uh, the Facebook stuff, the, the YouTube stuff when you can. So if you guys log on YouTube, you probably see some answers from Petter helping people out. Partner, turn that sound up. In case you guys haven't noticed, we're in an industrial complex, mainly because uh, as luck would have it, an industrial complex in Newton, New Jersey is not very expensive. So uh, that's that's how we got here. Top of the pile, hotter than Brimstone. What's this y'all? But don't start riffing. Partner, turn that sound up. Now we're kind of coming into into the build room. Um, you can see we got like lots of stuff everywhere, which is kind of how it kind of how it happens when. Uh, you know, you're not necessarily professional business people, you're, you're skateboarders. Yeah, kind of like everybody's got their own vibe and, uh, you know, we're, we're really into that. So um, a lot of the guys decorate their stations however they want to and um, that's what all this junk is. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty much the office and the build and this is where we have a lot more of the fun. All right. Hey, Bishop. Hey, what's up, dude? Want see a trick? Yeah. It's the couch, man. If you guys haven't seen the new uh, concrete wave issue, that's Bishop on that mega ramp right here yep. in this warehouse. Yeah. It's really cool to be here and check all this out in real life. Right. Tell us about this mini mega. When did you guys put this together? Uh, the, the mini mega is actually about a year and a half old now. Um, for us normal people, it's about an eight foot early grab. You know, if you're a Superman like Fish, then you're looking at 12 or 15. Speaking um, of 12 or 15 working. feet, how far is that one? The one on the cover, that was more like a, a 20 foot. You know, Bish is not just skating every day. Bish is training to get stronger every day. Your calves are not strong enough. Your core is not strong enough right now to do the things that you see on a snowboard. Um, so literally people have to start taking this seriously as a sport. You know, these guys are professional athletes and that is a possibility in longboarding. Um, I'm really proud of that. I don't think that there's anybody out else out there who would even think that it's worth building a ramp to early grab off of. You know what I mean? Like everybody else from, from shortboard skateboarding and all the longboard companies who are based there think this is a joke. To those people, I think that um, fish starting to stick to 360s, so light might start to go off. I'm not, the basic idea of all of this stuff is that we're just getting started. I remember always skating out front of my house on my little shorty and then all of a sudden one day Tony Hawk does a 900 and then totally. Bob Burnquist and day. Danny Way yeah. are playing on a real gigantic mega yep. ramp yep. and yeah. the progression of, of the shortboard skateboard industry and then being here today and seeing Bish landing 360s over yeah. a gap and I don't know, it's reminiscent and it's really exciting. It's, it's special, it's really special and um, you know that's that's just the beginning like we didn't we didn't build the ramp for what we're doing right now we built the ramp for what we think is possible five years from now. I'm Brian Davenport. This is Push Culture News. We've been out in Newton, New Jersey at the original Skateboard Headquarters. We'll see you next time.